If you want to make 2026 the best year for your brand and you're not leveraging AI creatives that look like this. My boyfriend just spent $300 on jewelry that I'm about to destroy. You heard about the miracle hair growth oil that's going viral on my For You page? it actually works. You're not gonna make it. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can generate ad creatives that look real, look native, can hold your product, and can be made quickly and affordably every single week without jumping around different AI platforms and without it looking like AI slop. And look, before you ask me whether these ads convert, I've scaled these ad accounts to multiple four and five figure days using AI generated ads. So if you're just sitting and waiting on creators that are gonna miss deadlines and deliver subpar videos, your competitors are going to outbid you on Meta. So Today we're going to be using a platform called Max Fusion. This has the most up-to-date AI models, including Sora 2 Pro, and a fantastic limp syncing one that I haven't seen anybody else out there use. But not only that, you can generate images and B-roll inside it, so it's basically a one-stop shop for everything. So let's just start making some ads right now. Now what we're going to do is follow this framework here. Step one is to generate a hook with Sora 2 Pro because it gives you the most realistic AI visuals. Step two is to clone that creator and their voice so we have character consistency. And step three is to add B-roll and stuff on top to make it more realistic and not look like AI. So Sora 2 Pro has been trained on viral content seen organically on platforms like Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube, and these are viral videos. So I can go to Max Fusion, click Sora 2 Pro, make it 916, 12 seconds long, 1080p, and this little box here allows me to add a high quality image of our product. And as you can see, I'm testing it with this product right here. And when I generate the video, this is what I get. My boyfriend just spent $300 on jewelry that I'm about to destroy. But there's a massive limitation with Sora 2 Pro that many people do not know how to get over. And it's why when you give video editor all the freedom to make AI videos, they just can't get it right, which is why they don't convert. The problem is that you are actually limited to 12 seconds long video and you can't generate another video using the same consistent character. You literally get an error because that is a limitation that OpenAI put into Sora 2 Pro. But what if I told you there was a new AI model inside Max Fusion that allows you to take this character, make a duplicate of it and make a realistic talking head video with it that has perfect lip syncing. Now, I don't know how long this is going to be around for and I don't know if it's going to always be this good, but I would jump in it before your competitors because this is probably one of the best ones I've seen. So the first you have to do is actually find a good screenshot of the creator from the Sora 2 Pro video. This is the screenshot we're going to take. Now I'm going to go to the images section in Max Fusion and I'm going to paste in this image and I'm going to click here where it says create image. Now there is an option called banana clone, but this is only if you just want to get a reference image and clone it to look like that image with a different person. So I'm going to choose Nano Banana Pro because this is the best AI generation model out there. And in this situation, I'm going to remove everything from her hand so we have a clean image. I can now click here and click save to act a library. Now what I can actually do is change her location and what she's wearing so that we have different scenarios of her talking and it kind of makes the video not look so much like AI. So as you can see here, I now have this person in different locations just by having a simple prompt like put her in a bathroom. Now prepare yourself because this is going to get crazy. We're going to use a new AI model called Riz. Now not that kind of Riz. So when you get back to the video section, click here, change it to Riz. And now you're going to see that there are three things. A prompt to give your actor emotions and gestures, an audio script and a start frame. And this is where it gets crazy. <laughs> crazy because I have the frame from that Nana Banana actor that I created, which is consistent with the Sora 2 Pro creator. And if I click audio script, there are two options, generate speech and upload audio. Now look what happens if I click generate speech. That's right. You can actually add 11 labs to Max Fusion so you can use their library of voices, but we're not going to do that. What we're going to do instead is actually clone the voice of the Sora 2 Pro video so that we have even better character consistency. Okay. Now I'm going to show you how to generate a voice clone if your video is less less than 10 seconds long from Sora. And you guys sometimes actually get a better result. So let me show you. What I did is I went to 11 labs. I went to create a clone voice. So when I click voice design, it gives you basically a prompt. So essentially what I wanted to write here was a prompt to make a voice that sounded like my example. Gen Z, American female who speaks very fast because she has ADHD, comes from a wealthy background. And I click generate voice. Essentially, I did this process with this creator until I heard one that sounded very similar. If you can't hear a difference, then it's perfect. Then you click select the voice. Now we're going to go back to Max Fusion, click audio script, generate speech, and then select the voice we just cloned. Then we can actually paste in our script and this is what it sounds like. Here is a Sora 2 Pro video. My boyfriend just spent $300 on jewelry that I'm about to destroy. And here is the voice. I'm going to wear them both for one week straight and see which one survives. But for me, my favorite part is that you're able to add specific emotion tags to the voice, which comes with the new update with 11 labs. You see how everything is just all in one space. I love that. And now all we have to do is click generate and we've created a whole new talking head video with perfect lip syncing. 
I'm going to wear them both for one week straight. Now sure, some stuff might not come out as good. You can always regenerate. That's with every AI model. And now I can create a lip sync model for the different locations that I created for the creator. Pieces, yes, seven. And you can generate ones like this. Go to this page, pick out seven pieces of waterproof jewelry. But what if you want to generate B-roll? So footage to go on top of the creator doing stuff with the product. So it looks more realistic. All you have to do is change the model to Kling 2.6 and you give it different instructions with an image of the person doing something that you generated with Nano Banana. So you can see here, I've just made this creator do a whole bunch of different things. I can make it do whatever I want for the video. And with all that put together, this is what the final ad looks like. My boyfriend just spent $300 on jewelry that I'm about to destroy. <clears throat> so here's the deal. I have two sets of jewelry. This one from a boutique and this one from Louise Carter. I'm going to wear them both for one week straight and see which one survives. Day one, shower test. Day three, beach day. Day five, hot yoga class. Day seven, still haven't taken them off. So after one week, the boutique bracelet is already tarnishing. But this still looks brand new because it's 18 karat PVD gold, which literally cannot tarnish. Here's the girl math. Right now for Christmas, go to this page, pick out seven pieces, yes, seven of waterproof jewelry. Guaranteed color for life. But there's one thing that I missed, the script. Because if you don't know how to make high converting realistic scripts, your ads will sound like AI. So watch this video right here and I'll show you exactly how you can do that in minutes. Don't make ads that sound like a bot. I'll see you there. Peace.